Cap Fact. William Burnside, a.k.a. the 50s Cap, was the final replacement that we're going to talk about in this series. Burnside was a bit obsessed with Captain America, and so he made it his life mission to recreate the super soldier serum. And he eventually did, and agreed to give it to the U.S. government on the condition that he be the first one to receive it. Eventually, the government decided to not go through with the program, but Burnside decided to go through with it anyway and injected himself and a young man named Jack Monroe with the serum. They both got superpowers and ended up being stronger than the original Cap, but it kind of degraded their minds and made them crazy and racist, basically. The two were eventually revived, and they soon came into conflict with Steve, who was again acting as Captain America, because they thought he was an imposter. And there's actually a lot more story to these two, so I'll probably cover those another time. Though talking about those two always gets a little awkward because their path to villainy started with their obsession with Captain America and, you know, it's a little too close to home. <laughs>